Hello everybody, good morning. Welcome back to my channel. Today we are gonna talk about 11 super easy car camping breakfast ideas. It is the morning. I'm just hanging out here with a cup of coffee and these breakfast ideas are the ones that I go to all the time because they're just really easy. You don't want to have a super elaborate stressful breakfast when you're at camp just trying to relax. Some of these are going to be kind of really obvious. A lot of them are no cook and then we also have some cooking ones that just require a camp stove and a pan. So super easy. <laughs> In the description box below there is a link to the blog post that goes with this which will have printable recipes and just other resources that you can actually take with you camping. Number one is just good old classic scrambled eggs with either some toast or some bacon on the side. I like to throw some spinach and some cheese in there. So of course you can vary it up however you want, but just putting some eggs in the cooler is always one of our go-to breakfasts because it's just a good amount of protein, some fat, and it just really fills me up for the day. Number two is what I call the ultimate breakfast sandwich, and this is on my blog. It is just a fried egg with some cheese, bacon, and a little bit of green onion on a toasted English muffin. I make the whole thing in a cast iron pan. It's really, really easy and very filling. Definitely more of a decadent breakfast, but it is delicious. And of course, with a breakfast sandwich, like really most of these things that we're gonna talk about, you can vary it up however you want. Personally, the addition of the, the fresh green onion on the sandwich is really what takes it up a level, but of course, you don't have to bring that if you don't want. You can just keep it simple with bacon, egg, and cheese. Never go wrong with that combo. <laughs> Next up is cereal. So I have taken a box of cereal, just put it in my food bin, and then brought some milk in the cooler. Boom, no cook breakfast. That's all you need. If you have a bigger group, this might be a really great option because again, everyone can just pour a bowl of cereal. There's hardly any cleanup, no cooking nice and easy. Number four is yogurt with berries and some granola, maybe some honey. For this one, all you have to do is just put some yogurt and some berries in the cooler. And then I like to pre-make my granola at home. You can also just buy a granola. I love to make homemade granola. It's just really cheap. It's really simple. So you just do that at home, bring it along with you in your food bin, and you have another no cook breakfast idea. I prefer whole milk Greek yogurt for this. It's just so creamy and delicious and really, really filling. It's got some protein, got some fats, and we got carbs from the berries and the granola. So it's just a really good, well-rounded breakfast. Number five on this list is pancakes. I like to bring some blueberries or some bananas to just change things up, even some chocolate chips. I really like these Kodiak cake power cakes flapjack and waffle mix in the buttermilk flavor but these are really really good and they have a lot of protein there's whey protein in the mix and so they're just really filling these are the ones that Nick and I use a ton like I said I'll throw some blueberries in there or some banana just to change things up give it some variety but these are kind of the ones that we use a lot I would recommend getting a mix that just has just add water options so that again all you do is just put it in a bowl add water you're ready to cook <laughs> number six is another no cook option and it is just a classic bagel and cream cheese my dream favorite bagel on earth is a toasted everything bagel with a scallion cream cheese so you can toast the bagel just cut it in half and just put it in your cast iron pan and give it a good toast that way and then for the cream cheese just throw that in the cooler done if you don't even care about it being toasted then it's a no cook breakfast i like to add a little bit of green onions into my cream cheese because i could put green onions on almost everything i just love them so that's kind of my ideal bagel if you bring a few different kinds of bagels everyone could just make their own and breakfast is done number seven is french toast I love a good French toast. It is a really easy meal to make when you're camping. On my blog, I have a recipe for a peanut butter, banana, honey French toast that I make when I go camping, but you can just keep it really simple with the classic French toast. It's very customizable and a delicious way to kind of change up the breakfast if you've been making a lot of pancakes and you just want to change things up. French toast is always a good option. <laughs> Number eight is a breakfast burrito. 
this is another one that Nick and I go to all the time. In fact, breakfast burritos were one of the first things that Nick ever cooked for me. And he's kind of the one that cooks the burritos because he does such a good job. He has like his special little recipe. <laughs> we love these because they're just really, really filling and you can make a few of them easily, kind of cook all the eggs together and then it's just a matter of assembling. You can put cheese, you can put sausage, you can put spinach, you can put kale, whatever things you want to add, beans, cheese. The options are endless, salsa, so you can kind of Think about the kind of burrito that you wanna make, maybe write out a list and then make sure you pack all those ingredients. But once you actually get to camp, it's super easy and it's one that we go to all the time. Number nine is breakfast tacos. All you gotta do is scramble some eggs. I like to do some peppers and some onions and just layer things on with some cheese, salsa, cilantro, sour cream, Boom, so good. And then just you know fry a tortilla in your pan, put it all together and is delicious. <laughs> Number 10 is oatmeal with some fruits and nuts and maybe some honey. Oatmeal is a classic backpacking breakfast for me. I eat it all the time when I'm at home, so it's very natural that I would also eat it when I'm camping. You just need really one pot for this, so it wouldn't really, I guess, work in the cast iron pan, but just a pot and some water, maybe bring some milk along if you want it to be a little bit creamier, cinnamon, and then just top it with some nuts and seeds and maybe some peanut butter or almond butter honey you get the deal it's again completely customizable and super filling and easy for a big group of campers and lastly we have breakfast quesadillas these are so good i have a recipe for a pepper and bacon breakfast quesadilla on my blog and it's just simple and delicious like all the things on this list no need to overcomplicate things for breakfast quesadillas you just scramble some eggs and then just layer in the cheese and whatever other toppings and things that you want such as peppers bacon and then dip it in some salsa and sour cream <laughs> all right so that is it for these easy camping breakfast ideas i hope you get a chance to try some of these and just have a really slow chill stress-free morning in the sunshine with some beautiful views and some great company let me know Know in the comments below what some of your favorite camping breakfast ideas are I'd love to try some new ones and make sure to subscribe to my channel so that you don't miss a video I'll see you in the next one peace